Hello there, Quindexter here again, and today, amongst doing four floor patterns, my creative testing world is not exactly immense, but I have been breeding horses, and I want super fast horses. Horses are all the rage back in Minecraft again, and I want the best ones, so I need to know which are the best ones. And I have been working on this, which is a design, which I will post a link to its original creator. I've made a couple of tweaks. But I think this is going to help us know which is the fastest horse on the server. And I'm going to go and build this, find somewhere and build this in survival mode. Because doing it in creative is just cheating. And I'll make mistakes along the way. And you get to see those as I do it. But uh, let's quit this one for now. And let's get back into the realm. I'm back on the realm. And, well, it's already getting night time. Uh, let me just fix that for a second. And yeah, somebody started a realm at my village of breeding ground again, so I've boxed him up. He's he's living up there at the moment. Anyway, uh, I'm breeding horses with swiftness, slowly but surely. They're over there, waiting for them to grow up, or I could feed them wheat, I suppose. And first of all, we need to gather some resources. So, up to the base. Oh, got beacons didn't record that but that was a lot of graft right so the racetrack is probably gonna be about as long as this 31 so we can do the maths to see which is you know which is faster we want kind of horse miles per hour I want some coarse dirt because I want it to look like a kind of a racetrack and I think if my maths I need about 125 of oh dear Right, okay, I'm just gonna... I know where there is gravel. I'm gonna go and get some gravel. Back in a second. Right, back again after a little bit of digging. Always the way on survival. You think you've got everything you need, and then... Bam. You don't. So, I've got now... You wanna see the back of my head? No. Or the front? No. Right, so I have... Uh, an empty shulker and I'm going to fill that with the things that I, I, I think I'm going to do this by memory I've got my redstone box there <clears throat> I got my riches over there uh, first of all need like 120 130 coarse dirt was that just that one coarse dirt again so what's that 128 should be enough I think that's going to be enough get a few more right okay so coarse dirt two three right uh, definitely have some wood oh, actually no we need some pressure plates we need uh, one two three eight eight pressure plates uh, pressure 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 nope eight of those and whack them in we're gonna need probably three or four hoppers I'll put four in just in case we're gonna need two comparators we're gonna lead at least I think it's three redstone repeaters uh, we're gonna need a bunch of redstone Whack a lever in just in case. Anything up? Gonna need some chests. Put those in. Only need two chests, but better safe than sorry. Put uh, may not need that much, but good enough. Gonna need some droppers. So one, two, three droppers. Whack a dispenser in because I don't have another dropper. Might end up needing four, but I think it's only three. We'll put those in to begin with. Right, okay. Don't need any redstone torches. Don't need any buttons. Don't think we need anything else. No pistons involved. I think, generally speaking, that is going to be... the kind of the main elements to it. 
yeah. So, I mean, it's not a difficult build. It's just, it's just a racetrack. I'm gonna go and put these away. Don't want anybody coming in and taking them. Right. Those two boxes are fine, and now we need to go and find a space to go digging and starting. That sound. So I was thinking we've got the stables down here with the breeding, but there's nowhere really around here that's worth it. And I don't want to build here because other people will build here. But out the back here where I've got my sugarcane farm, or even down here on the way to the harbour, maybe there's something we could do out here. I think this is going to be a good space. This one. It's flat. Definitely got rid of some trees. Well, got some logs. And it's getting dark. So I think we're going to go and sleep and then we'll, we'll push it out. So we need 31 blocks, 31 blocks um, distance to do the right timings, I, I'll talk about that a little bit later. Um, I think, how are we going to do that, we're going to do, um, well we want it here, and it needs to be four wide, so we'll just pick some ground, about, um, well, if we're going to get the horses round here, have something over there, okay, so about here, one, two, three, four. Right, okay. We want it to end before the ravine, I think. Probably makes sense. How many is that? No, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. That is... Well, that, that's pretty good. 2, 3, so we've got 4 down this way. Okay, let's block lag. It's just uh, I do have a very messy inventory, but let's fill in the holes as we go. So I'm gonna carve out this 31 by 4 space. Always on survival realms, this is just. You know, just gathering and getting distracted and doing other things. It's and then it gets night time. It's not great, is it? Let's sleep. Do we have sleepers on the server? We do. Am I the only person on the server? No, Rex is here too. Right, so we've got a full inventory, we've got a space logged out over here, 31 blocks wide, and we want, I want this to be like a dirt track, so we'll do coarse dirt, here we go, I'm going to need probably at least two stacks plus a little bit extra. Let's try this. And we're going to have our pressure plates on this side to, like, when we get our horse on, he'll run down here, hopefully faster than me, and he'll end over here. And we'll have signals both sides to determine which one is the fastest. 
and it's not it's not massive amounts of redstone anybody can do this uh, let's get my spade first things first we want to dig down underneath where our starting block is going to be okay pick up those bits of dirt so we'll have pressure plates across the top and we'll have redstone so as soon as you press like redstone travels down through a block so that will activate the redstone on this side okay that's that's a good starting way and then what we'll do is if I need to remember this I'm just gonna put a random block in line with where our pressure plates are going to be. Actually, we could put our pressure plates down now. That'd be good. Right, uh, we've got eight of those. We're fine. So we've got one, two, three, four pressure plates on this side. Hang on a second. No, this should, this should be right. One, two, three, four on that side. Right. And you'll be able to see, maybe if I bring this a little bit closer, I won't have to keep running over to it. Right, let's get some redstone. One, two, three, four, underneath the pressure plates, okay. And we'll put one there, but I'm not even sure if, if you're going to be able to see that. Yeah, you could. Right, okay, great. So you push the pressure plate, it sends a signal down, activates the redstone, goes into there. Next one is, in order to actually get our redstone signal all the way to where we do our timers and everything else, we're going to put a block here and a repeater. Redstone generally travels for about 15 blocks. And if you need to extend it, that's what repeaters are there for. Well, and other things, but in this instance. And we're going to actually do the same thing on this side. Get a way out. Under here. Okay, so redstone on this side. And we put a block, any block will do. Use that one, doesn't matter. It's all gonna be hidden up underwoods. Underwoods, underneath, underwoods. <laughs> I like it, underwoods. So now we know that if you tread on that, it turns your redstone on, puts a signal into this block. And we want that block to extend all the way down here. It can't extend all the way down there because that's more than 15 blocks because it's, it's like 31 wide. But if we want it to go in the middle, it's 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So here... Mm, Todd. Fourteen will be from both sides. They can power that. Okay. So now we need to just carve out a three wide area. And this is where we're going to put our clock to do the timing and everything else that's probably that's probably too much but good enough for me All right and for that I'm gonna need uh, droppers hoppers well I'm gonna need repeaters comparators I think that's probably that's probably it so the first one we want facing up bottom up right 
And then the second one we want facing into, and you can see the, with the light gray here, right? So that's facing into that one, right? And then this one we want to face happy days to the top of this dropper and shift and click that should be well oh my god it's getting dark oh i'm gonna die i'm gonna die 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 die, die. i hope rex is sleeping always carry a bed always carry a bed on a no one bed sleep server not x's no kisses here Zzz. always like the sleeping crew right so we have this and I'm going to put one item in here that should go into that dropper and then we do the the redstone I'm not going to explain this because you know I know my I know a little bit about electronic circuits but and nor nor gate stuff if it works copy it so we do that we do that so um, we have a comparator into a repeater we create another comparator we put that to subtract mode and then we take out our redstone and we get a super fast redstone clock who's clicking by me right so that it's the pig you are ruining how I explain how this works and I can do that food right so in theory that's running we have our fast horse fail that should be off thank you and that should be back on again nice it works sue me okay so here and here so now we've got the redstone that's powering this and it will also come up in this direction we'll do one more dirt and then let's go to changing the look a little bit okay I think that's going to be is that going to be high enough I think that's going to be high enough we want to take when it pulses back out we want to make sure that that works in this direction <laughs> still got super jump right and we have our chests chests do we have chests yes we do let's take our chests and the next thing you want to do like from this I guess is one chest I think that's all we kind of need um, to do this we want to fill let's put dirt in here the idea is right so you activate it here you stop over there activating it over here on the pressure plates sends a signal down here into the T flip flop into this one right that activates up here and this starts spitting out items so you want to put you want to put items in your 
dropper, 64 should be enough for any, like even the slowest horses, they should, they should be able to um, do a timing in here. Pretty good. Just in case runoff. I don't want people falling into a chasm, right? And we've got spare dirt. The next thing to do is actually build up some sort of like nice enclosure to this. I've got wood and everything else. Uh, let me just go and do that and then we'll come back. Okay, so I've tidied up the little redstone -y place, okay, just to make it, well, it's not, it's, it's not amazing, but it's not dirt, uh, and that'll do, that'll do, I think, and over here, we have our entrance for the horses, and they come in here, they run down the track, and they get timed. Jumping will come later. But for now, it's about how fast horses are. Let's go and get some horses. We're going to go for Bill first, we're going to go for Mr. Speedy second, and as yet unnamed, and if you're better, you might get named. You might be one of the herd. You probably are. You're a good looking horse. Alright, so, Bill, let me just go and make sure that this is empty. Nope. Okay. Hmm. Okay, Bill. Let's see how fast we are. Okay, we're going. We're ready. Okay. Let's put you back. Bill, you're still fast. You're still fast. Okay, uh, let's go and have a look and see what that was. Eight. That was eight. It's not bad. Okay, and next one up is Mr. Speedy. Mr. Speedy, you are my favorite. Uh, uh. What? Oh, oh, stop it. Am I on Mr. Speedy? Okay, Mr. Speedy. Okay. Same way. Let's go. Let's put you back. Okay, and what were you? Eight. Okay. Eight you are. Okay. And we'll see the new... The, oh, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Not Bill. New horse. And we go. So, better than eight. That's what we want to go for. Nine! I think we've hit the limit of our horses. I'm not sure whether that was success or not. 
not sure if that was good or not. Maybe I'll expand it to 62 blocks. I'll have to, I'll have to see. But so far, the general mechanics, they worked. And Bill, you are going to be our test subject, number one. You're not going to the uh, dog food factory just yet. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Okay. Well, that's the end of this video. I hope you liked it. Um, not sure it was totally successful, but it was something. Quindexter out.